Eric. Now to a developing story. Deputies are investigating a train crash involving five members of a family, including children, all five who died last night in Hillsborough County. We are told two more people are fighting for their lives at a local hospital. The tragedy happening on Highway 92 and Jim Leffler Circle. This is in Plant City. The family on their way to a birthday party just over the tracks. News Channel 8's Nicole Rogers joining us now live from the scene in Plant City. Nicole, just a horrible tragedy. Melissa, it's absolutely devastating and heartbreaking. I just spoke with the family and they just confirmed with me a couple minutes ago that one of those two people fighting for their lives in the hospital has now passed away, all because of what happened here last night in Plant City. The sheriff says the family was on their way to a girl's 15th birthday party in a Cadillac Escalade when the driver approached this railroad crossing. It was just as a freight train was headed toward them at 55 miles per hour. We're told the engineer tried to signal with a horn to get the driver's attention and slow down the train, but just couldn't stop the train in time. It's what happened next that the sheriff said took that the sheriff said took the lives of now six people, including children, and now at this hour has one more person fighting for their life. As you could imagine, the carnage that's created when these two collide. The SUV. We can see from the video begins to catapult and flip violently several times before it's landed. Now, if you take a look, this is exactly where this happened. You can see there is a stop sign here, but what you don't see is those big crossing arms or lights. Now, make sure that you stay tuned. Coming up on News Channel 8 at 930, we speak with a railroad safety expert on why those items were not here at this crossing. For now, live in Plant City, Nicole Rogers, 8 on your side.